Well, hey friends, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're gonna be doing a home slash grocery haul. Majority of it's grocery, but let's start with the random stuff. So, um, I needed air filters, and I also needed some batteries. So, I stopped at Menards. So, I needed some of these nine volt batteries, and then I was gonna go change my air filter, and I'm like, oh man, I don't have two of them, or I don't have an extra. Usually what I try to do is, when I change it, I like make a point to go and get another one, but forgot to do that. So now I had to buy two. So anyway, it all ended up working out. If this will stand up for me. Um, so anyway, that's what I got at Menards. And my total at Menards was $27.76. All right, and then the rest of this, like, Basically from here over is Aldi, and then from here over is Cub. So let's start with Aldi. I got some bread. I've got three sweet potatoes, because I thought that would be delicious. I got some mushrooms, ground turkey, zucchini, some baby carrots, uh, milk. No, not milk. Ah, the milk behind it. All right, white milk and chocolate milk. And then I also got some eggs and some tomatoes and then some grated cheese. I usually have to supplement from Aldi to get some things at Cub that are more brand name. So let's go into the Cub. Um, I did get cheese at Cub for Doyle. I got some A1 sauce. There was a sale on these, <laughs> clearly. And I actually like these for lunch. They're just really good. They were like, I don't know, two for six bucks. And I think they're normally like three forty nine dollars or something. But it's just like a really quick, easy lunch that I don't have to make, which is kind of nice. But this is my favorite one. It's the wine infused salami. And um, they're good until December 20th. So I figured I would definitely use those. Um, I don't eat these every day, but it's just like a really good thing in a pinch if I don't have any leftovers or something. Um, I also got some flour tortillas. I got these and um, funny story about these, I'll tell you in a second. But anyway, these are just like more of the like wrapped pumpkin ones. I don't know, just like regular milk chocolates. And then I got some gala apples. And then I have these as well. Um, so I forgot that I threw these in my cart, which is funny because I only had like this much stuff in my cart. And I saw those up by the register and I was like, oh, I need doves for, I was like, oh, I thought I looked at doves, but I'm like, oh, maybe I didn't put them in my cart, whatever. And I was like not paying attention. And I was like in the very front of my cart, like where my, I like put my purse, like where like a baby would sit. And I just like threw them in there. And then I like started putting stuff on the conveyor belt and I'm like, oh crap, I've got way too much chocolate, but oh well. It'll get eaten. I actually have like a little dish at my desk that like everyone can help themselves to. So I like doves, I like milk chocolate. So I'll put both of these out at some point. I'll probably start with these because there's little pumpkin faces on them. So yeah. And just for reference at Aldi, which is right here and over, I spent $18.66. And then everything over at Cub was $69.26. Definitely this was more of a splurge just because of all the chocolate and all the name brands of things, but that's just what happens when you go shopping sometimes. But anyway, that is it for my weekly haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, feel free to post them down below. If you like these hauls and me showing you like random household things and stuff once in a while, make sure to give the video a thumbs up so I know, or you can leave a comment and tell me down below. Thank you so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys! Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so 